Hey, welcome back everybody. Thanks for tuning in again. Today we decided to make a video for you on baby travel essential needs. We figured it's a simple thing, but maybe a lot of you guys out there are actually wondering what you should take traveling with you and what's necessary for a newborn baby. Our son's only two months old and we figure these are some of the essentials that we like to bring with us and it's pretty necessary for us. Some of these might do a little overkill for you guys as far as the size of it, but we have them at home. We decided not to buy an additional travel size, even though they do tra sell travel sizes and just bring these with us. So let's get into the gear and show you what we brought. So everybody's baby essential needs are gonna be very different and be very customizable depending on what your specific needs are, how old your baby is, and where you guys are going. So we traveled for a couple days and we wanted to bring a couple things that are just gonna make our life a lot easier here with the baby. And we've researched some of these things and figured out these things are very, very nice to have and makes it just a lot simpler for you when you're traveling. So let's get into some of the differences and some of the different items we have here and what they do. All right, so starting off here with the breast pump. This is battery powered. You charge this thing up and it lasts for about maybe four different pumps, 30 minutes each before you have to recharge the battery. So it's awesome that you can just be in the car or wherever you are, pump and put your milk into a cooler, whatever you need. So it works on, like I said, battery power. Also has a light on it so you can see what you're doing at nighttime. It has a display so you can see how many minutes are left, how long you're pumping for. Everything is removable and washable so you can remove all the gear from this and wash it. So this brand is called Spectra. You have two different ways you can go about it. You can purchase this thing on Amazon or you can get it through your insurance provider. Just make sure when you get it through your insurance provider that they're offering you the battery powered version, not the electric plug-in version, unless that's what you want because the battery powered version is this one specifically that requires you to just charge it and take it on the go with you. It comes with these bottles that you attach to the pump. It's gonna go ahead and remove the milk from your breast and then you can just go ahead and, rip and place these bottles into any area you want. You can cap it and just put it in a cooler until you get back home or wherever you're going, you can just go ahead and put it in the fridge or freeze it depending on what you need to do. All right, so next on the list here, we have the bag which we put the breast pump into. We didn't purchase this, this was actually given to us by the pediatrician when we went to the office for the baby's first visit. It's like a cooler, but what we use it for, we put the breast pump in here and we take the uh, everything that goes for the breast pump, we just take this in the car with us everywhere we're going. Even if we're just going to Costco for a couple hours to the restaurant, we're going on a trip, whatever it is, we store everything in this bag so we can take it with us anywhere very easily and very compact. So it's nice to have this whole gear set up in one space. Inside the side pocket of the bag, we keep the bottle here, which is for sterilizing the bottles on the go. Uh, this is a spray, so you spray it on the breast pump bottles and that will sterilize them for you so you don't have any kind of bacteria or anything building up for you because it obviously may be difficult for you to get some water access or soap access on the go. So you just spray this on there, it'll clean it up and remove all that bacteria for you. In the front pocket of the bag, we keep the wipey version of it as well. So if you want to just go ahead and wipe it down with these wipes, you can wipe down the bottles and have that sterilized without having to make any kind of spray or mess around you. So next up here is our bottle warmer. We go everywhere with this because if your baby is like ours, he likes to have warm water or just room temperature water, you can say, you need to have this. They have different versions which are very uh, you know, user friendly as far as being able to travel with it, the smaller package and all that. And we've seen a ton of them online, but we already had this one. It's small enough where we can fit it in any bag and just bring it with us and plug it up. The one downfall would be that you cannot warm up the milk on the go, as far as if you're in a, maybe in the car and you don't have an electrical plug to plug it into. They do have battery powered versions for this, but for the most case, when the, we're on the go and the baby wants a drink, he just goes ahead and breastfeeds directly. We just do this when we're at a spot where we can go home and warm up the milk, then we use this for us. Uh, but it's fantastic. You just press the button here, set it to the desired temperature you want, add a little bit of water inside and the milk will warm up for you. Next on our list here, this is not really a baby essential, but it is a mommy and daddy essential. If you wanna be awake, like for example, this morning we were up at four in the morning with the baby. This is a coffee maker on the go. It is battery powered. You put your pot in, add a little water on the top. It will then boil the water itself and then it will dispense the espresso for you. So this is how we make coffee on the go. It's it with us in the car at all times. We don't have to take any coffee maker with us, any big thing. We always have coffee anytime we need it. This is a skip hop little lunch kind of cooler bag type of thing. The way we use it is to store our bottles when we're on the go. So after my wife pumps the milk, we will go ahead and then store the milk into this bag. What we do is if you open up the zipper, you have a spot here. We have this Yeti ice, which I have a ton of Yeti ice. We use this one because it specifically fits in here perfectly. Uh, they bring their own version for this, but Yeti ice works a lot better. So we pop it in here. And then we have space usually to store about two bottles, uh, one on each side next to each other, or maybe one on top of the other a little bit. But that would be enough from obviously breast, both breasts, 
uh, whatever milk she pumps out, we can store it in here, keep it cool to get back home and we can put it into the fridge. All right, if your baby is like ours and he absolutely needs to have a bath at night because our baby loves to bathe at night and it's just like his routine. He likes to bathe and go to sleep. I don't know why, he just loves it. It feels a lot more comfortable and sleeps better. So we bring this chair with us and this little bottle. This is a collapsible bathing chair. So you can go ahead and collapse this whole thing down and when you go ahead and go to travel, it's super nice and easy that it's so compact and lays flat and you can take it anywhere with you. So we go ahead and put this into the shower, lay him on here and then shower him. And we use this like silicone kind of cup that they sell for uh, bathing the babies and we go ahead and just fill this up with the warm water and we go ahead and add, pour that onto him. Um, so it's really nice of him to have something you can take with you anywhere and shower him without having to have some you know, crazy contraptions or maybe get into a dangerous situation where you have to hold them over the sink or anything like that. This is essentially made for this. This is the Baby Breeze Up Bottle Sterilizer. It's fantastic. This is the one we use at home and it's really, really nice. It's big because like I said, we use it at home. They do sell smaller versions of this so you can take it for you when you go traveling. This pretty much what you do is you add water it will go ahead and sterilize the bottles as well as dry the bottles. And it fits a ton of bottles in here all at once. So what we do is that we go ahead and wash the bottles out with soap and water. And then we add them in here, put some water in here. It will sterilize the bottles with steam and then it will dry them. So by the time you get the bottle, it is perfectly clean. No bacteria, nothing on there. So it's really, really nice to have that. Like I said, it is a little bit of a bigger package, but they do sell smaller versions you can take with you and travel. We were gonna buy an additional one since we already have it, but I do recommend you guys get this one. I will have links for all these things down in the description below if you guys are interested, so make sure you check that out. Okay, so right here we have the Angel Bliss uh, Baby Bouncer Chair, I think you can call it. Like I said, I'll put the description below so you guys can have all these links down there for you. My son loves this thing. It, it's a breathable material, so it has holes all around it, as you can see, so it'll breathe very nicely. He doesn't get hot in it, so he likes that very much, and it has like a bouncing feature to it where he can kind of bounce. So every time he kicks or moves in there, he bounces himself, so he, he spends a long, long time here. This entire thing collapses down to a flat package, so super portable, super collapsible. You guys know how much I like that, and the entire thing is washable. Obviously, you can't wash the, the wood itself. You can wash it with a little soap and water, but you can put this in the machine, and it'll wash for you in the, in the machine washer. Uh, with no problem at all. So I really like the fact that you can bring this with you. You can have a baby chair that you can travel without having some ginormous thing to try to fit in the car with everybody in the car. This thing is super lightweight and super packable. This right here is the Topol baby camera. Well, not necessarily a baby camera. It's a camera to have at home, but this thing works fantastic. My wife was super concerned when I went ahead and purchased this item because it said it was only $20 and she couldn't believe that for $20 it was gonna be any good. She thought the quality was gonna be cheap, it wasn't gonna work well. Let me tell you guys, this thing is super, super fantastic. It works great, the quality is amazing, it has a motion detection, so it literally is super sensitive. Anytime anybody or any movement is detected, it will notify you. The sound clarity on it is great, you can talk through it, you can hear through it. So we love the fact that we can just go ahead and link this up to our phone, to our iPad, and we can watch them wherever we are. So we bring this camping with us or traveling with us because if we're gonna go ahead and maybe be right outside on the porch and he's gonna be sleeping inside, we can plug this up right here and we can watch him from our phones and make sure that if he wakes up or he's doing any kind of movements, we know he's doing that and we can step right inside and take care of him. So if you guys are gonna be traveling and you don't wanna have to be you know, worried about if some, he's sleeping, you guys have to be stuck in the room with him, bring a little camera with you. That'll make your life so much easier and make it more enjoyable for all of you. The nocturnal vision on this thing is also fantastic. So once the nighttime drops and you think that low light is gonna be hard to see him, no, you can see it perfectly, like if almost they were the daytime. Um, it has these like infrared lights and you can see them with no problem at all. As you guys can see, I have this box right here that we take with us in so many different scenarios and situations. Sometimes it'll be a baby box, sometimes it'll be a camping box, sometimes it'll be a food box. It depends on what we're doing, where we're going. At this current moment in time, it is a baby box. So we're, everything is baby oriented as far as the pampers, uh, bottles, all those kind of things are in here. Just keep everything compact and very nice. If you guys are interested in hearing any more about this box and specifics and how this works, make sure to check out my other video. I did a comparison of all the different cargo boxes. You guys can see that on my channel as well. And I'll go into more details about this box. One of the things we keep in here are these baby diaper bags to go. Uh, if you guys are anything like us, you know that once you're on the road and you have diapers, they're going to be scattered all over your car and that's not something you want to have. So you want to make sure you have somewhere to dispose it. These little diaper bags are essential. You go ahead and pull it out, put the diaper in there, roll it up and get that nice and out of the way. So once you open the top packages here, we have all the baby's essentials. We have thermometers, we have medicines, uh, we have the nose Fritas, um, everything you can think of that the baby will possibly or maybe need at some point in time. Hopefully not. We do have the all sorted here, so we know exactly where to go. It's nice and easy. We don't gotta go scavenging for it anywhere. So that's really nice to have it organized up there. So on the top of the box, we have a couple things that might not be necessarily baby oriented, but at some point in time, you may need them. So we have them up here as well. Uh, we got a couple things, just like for example, 
uh, a lighter for whatever reason you don't know you might need that for whatever it may be uh, we do have some dish soap some dish towels so if we need to drop some things we got that all up here and when you go into the interior of the box uh, we got all of his diapers in here we got wipes uh, we got all of his bottles his baby bottles to go ahead and store milk uh, to go ahead and give him milk to go ahead and pump milk all those things are in there his baby bottle cleaner is also in there so if you need to clean out the bottles we have that so pretty much everything you will need is stored in this box uh, besides his clothing his clothing is in a separate bag that we usually keep that in but everything else that's you know home oriented or you know diapers you might need extra diapers extra wipes everything is all in this box so it's nice to go ahead and when you travel to be very organized and not have to look for things everywhere we are the kind of people that we're pretty tidy so once we like to travel we know to know where everything is and that's what this box is for all right guys well i hope you have enjoyed this video and i found them very informative if you guys have any other tips for us maybe other things that we can carry with us to make our life a little bit easier when we're traveling please make sure to put that in the comments and let us know otherwise if you guys have any other questions about any of the gear i have here make sure to put that down in the comments to let me know where your questions are i'll try to get to you as quickly as i can besides that please make sure to like subscribe turn on your full notifications we'll see you guys in the next one take care guys